Alright guys, uh, today I've got another launcher review, um, and this is going to be for MX Launcher, so let me just kind of show you what we got there under MX Launcher, uh, right here, here we go, it's MX uh, Home 3.0.5, and this is actually running on my Droid 3, but it should run on any gingerbread uh, ROM or stock uh, without any problems. Um, basically this is what it looks like when you get it. Uh, if I had more icons, probably more little stuff up on here. This has not got too much running on it. But uh, as you can see, there's a little animation when you change the page there on your icons. A little kind of bump there. Um, you can also change that. Let me show you some of the things you got on this. So you got all these buttons here when you hold down on an application. So it does a lot of different stuff here. You can uninstall it. You can get rid of it. You can adjust the size. Here's the size. You can actually stretch it out. Um, make it however big you want. But we don't, we don't really want to adjust it right now. Uh, let's see what else you can do. You can go to info, which you can now force close it, um, force stop it, cancel it, delete it, move it to your uh, SD card, all kinds of different stuff like that. Uh, you can see that right there. The other feature you have when you hold down onto it is this one. Now you can edit the con the uh, icon, you can change the name of it, a bunch of different settings you got there, which is pretty cool. And then the other one is this one, which right here just, just uh, does the animation. So I'm going to say no animation just for now. And then you're going to, the, the talk icon does not move when I change screens now. The other ones do, but it does not. So that's pretty neat. Um, I like those features. I like the little uh, theming they have here, these like rock looking things. Um, then we'll look at app drawer. This is your app drawer. It has a lot of different looks. You can have it like this. You can change it like icons like that. Um, you can do category things with it. Right here, you have applications, news. You can totally categorize everything and rearrange them in those categories. Tells you right here your SD card usage used on your SD or your mobile, which I like that little feature up there in the top. So that's really nice. Um, we got some more settings over here. This is where you would edit where things are at, what folders they're in. Which is what this stuff is, these little folders here. MX, applications. So you can do alphabetically, you can do categories, in the last 30 days, what's been installed recently. So a, a lot of different um, settings and options there, which I think is really nice in your app drawer. So... Um, yeah, that's, uh, that's kind of your look. This is another feature that's really cool, this little MX button right down here. And as you can see, this little balloon comes up, and it tells you your battery percentage on the balloon, which stays on every page, which is pretty cool. And then also you got these little things. A lot of times it's flowers. These are little, like, I don't know, sunflower seeds or something flying around. But when you touch the screen... There's more of them, so kind of a cool interactive wallpaper there. The other thing that's neat with it, let's see if I can get to a screen. We'll just let it sit here for a second. A lot of times, up oh, there it is. <laughs> a little airplane flies around through there, draws different stuff in the sky. It's it's just kind of cool. Uh, little neat neat little things on here uh, that are that are pretty neat. So I, I really do like the uh, the uh, uh, launcher. Like I said, it's MX launcher. It's pretty cool. The theming on it is good. You, there's, you know, you can change your your MX preferences. So you can get in here and you can change themes and download different themes, icons, dock bar settings, main screen, scrolling effects. You know, you got there's a lot of different thing here. Um, number of screens, transition effects. So let's see here. What's another good? Here we'll go cubed. We'll go back. And let's see. There's a little Skyrider again. Um, but you can see now when you transition, it's more of a cube looking thing uh, on your transition. So overall, I really like it. Uh, pretty cool, pretty fun to play with. Battery, like hot air balloons, pretty cool. And you can turn that on and off by just hitting that MX button down there in the dock bar. Also, your dock bar can take widgets. So here's a weather widget in my dock bar along with a uh, music widget in my dock bar because my dock bar scrolls. So, yeah, I really like it. Overall, really, really cool uh, launcher. 
Like I said, this is on uh, a gingerbread uh, ROM. I'm actually running MavROM 4.5, and I installed the launcher on it. But should it, this should work on any uh, gingerbread ROM or stock like I was telling you earlier. I don't know if it supports ice cream sandwich or jelly bean yet, um, <clears throat> but definitely works great in, on uh, gingerbread. So, yep, that's it, guys. That's my little review of uh, MX Launcher 3.0.5. Um, you can get it from uh, Google Play, so check it out and see if you guys like it. Thanks.